Hi everyone, welcome to Key to Blogging and in this video I will show you some security settings that we get in Cloudflare. So if you are using Blogger or WordPress website then you may face the bot attack or DDoS attack or any type of hacking. So Cloudflare will protect us from those threats. And if you are using AdSense then you might face the ad limit due to invalid traffic. So Cloudflare will increase the security level of your website. So if you are not using Cloudflare, then first of all, connect your website to Cloudflare and then log into your Cloudflare dashboard and here you will see this option security. And as you can see, it has blocked a lot of IP address for us. And as you can see, they have mentioned the country name and it will blocked by firewall rules. And here you can see the data during the last six hour or 12 hour or 24 hour, or you can select a custom range here. So first of all, let's click on the WAF and here we have set a firewall rule. So just click on the create firewall rule here. So let me just show you how it looks. So you need to create a name like this XML RPC block. So if you are using WordPress, then you should do these settings. So here in the field section, you will select the URL and here you can select the contents and here you can select the XML RPC.PSV. So the XML RPC page of your WordPress website will be blocked by firewalls. So in this way, you can improve your security in WordPress. Now let's click on back and let's click on firewall rule again. And let's click on cookies, countries, or you can select all the sections here. So if you want to block certain URLs or block a certain user agents like Bing bot or Google bot, you should not block the Google bot or Bing bot. But if you have some malicious bot is visiting again and again, then you can block that bot by clicking on the username and you can select the values. Now let's click on different options. So you can individually block a certain IP address by entering that IP address here so that in case if some IP address is creating bot attack in your website, then you can directly insert that IP address and set a firewall rule. So in this way, you can set different firewall rules inside your Cloudflare dashboard. Now let's click on the bot here. Now you will see an option like bot fight mode. So if you are getting bot traffic, then you should enable this option. And after that, it will set a JavaScript challenge to that bot. And if the bot failed, then it will block that bot. But it will skip all the important bots like Google bot, Bing bots. So you should not worry about that. So if you are getting bot traffic, then I recommend you to enable the bot fight mode. Now let's click on the DDoS settings here. And here Cloudflare will pro protect us from HTTPS DDoS protection, SSL and TLS DDoS attack and network layer DDoS attack. So these are all different type of DDoS attacks that Cloudflare will protect our website. So you can select the HTTP DDoS protection. So let's click on configure here. And here you can keep it as default and you can save the settings. Now let's click on the tools here. So you can set like user agent blocking that we have set in the firewall settings here. Now let's click on the settings here. Now here you will see this option security levels. So by default is set to medium. So if you are getting bot traffic, then you can change it to high or you can change it to I am under attack. So generally I set it to medium and you can also set the duration of challenge passage. So if a bot solve the JavaScript challenge, then it will not show the JavaScript challenge for 30 minutes. Then after that, it will again show that JavaScript challenge and it will only show when you set this option. I am under attack and here you can see this option browser integrity check and privacy pass support. So these are the privacy and security settings that you will get in Cloudflare so that it will help you prevent unnecessary bot traffic in your website. And if you are using WordPress, then I recommend you to use a plugins like WordFence. It also helps you prevent those malicious attacks on your website. So if you found this video helpful, then make sure to hit the like button and share your feedback in the comment sections. And I will see you in the next video.
थैंक यू